Right, so folks, let me introduce to you the one that I'll be talking to here in the studio. I told you earlier that Councillor John Luttred is here to talk about depression side of social media trolls and bullies and how our celebrities out there can handle some of these situations here. And of course, the show is now Councillor. So this is how we go. This way, this way, and then you swag small. Yeah, so let's go. What's the meaning? Well, I'm introducing you to the show. Um, I am a traditionalist. So, so how, you, you how, have to be very careful. So how do we do yours? I'm a witch. There are things you don't do with me. <laughs> okay, so permission to do this one. No, it's okay. Enough, it's okay. And I have to even clean it before you take the powers I brought. I brought some powers for the studio. You take it away by this means. They can send you to come and make us feel on studio and become depressed. Mm. But I'm inside. Well, yeah. Good to have you on the show, Council. Well, thank you too for having me mm. on the show. Greetings to all cherished uh, viewers and thank you for my clothing line. I always say thank you to them for keeping me outfit mm. like this. All right, so I'm here. Great. All right, now let's look at it from that side. Yesterday we had a conversation and mm -hmm. uh, a social media personality mm -hmm. who actually is a guru over there mm -hmm. spoke to us about how they can, you know, handle some of these issues in terms of how they deal with the trolls, mm -hmm. the bullies and all, in mm -hmm. terms of uh, accounts, mm -hmm. usage and all of that. Mm -hmm. uh, today we want to look at the side effect of it which happens to be depression that most of the celebs out there had to deal with. You know, people whose interest is to just go ahead and make fun of people on social media. It turns into a very bigger issue when depression comes. Papi Kojo actually recently in an interview says that he had depression through that. Well, thank you very much. Uh, I believe that the word depression mm. naturally is, if you check the DSM-4 that we're trained with, the simple definition is anger turned upside down. Anger turned upside down. That's the, that's the simplest definition you can give to depression. Okay. And depression is, is normal. Mm. It can affect anybody, everybody, anytime. Okay. The challenge is that when depression comes, what should one do? And how do you even identify that you are depressed? Right now, from the angle you are coming from, you are coming from social media. Uh, yeah, and celebrities for that matter. The, you see, the challenge is that the process by which celebrities are made, they are made on the premise of depression. Oh, I see. That's why they don't know. Because you are not born a celebrity. You are sitting here. Mm -hmm. You are just one of the children of your mother. Mm -hmm. Based on what you started doing, we have celebrated you. Mm. So, you don't have a public, anything called a private life anymore. Okay. That is why those who don't understand the game, where they are, if you're a lawyer and you are, you are sitting on a case, you can one day say that the case between George Lutrot and Mr. Kobe on social and so date, this is how the judgment was passed. Which means every incident that occurs mm -hmm. can be used for in discussion in the showbiz industry. Okay. But you can't sit here and discuss an issue that occurred with a fiasco nigger whose husband caught her cheating. Okay. They don't want you to talk about it. Mm. You talk about bon ones, they say don't talk about it. So this is our problem. Okay. That we come here, we talk about that Atlantis why bringing children for him to name. And uh, he should go and change the name. And they say, no, don't talk about it. It's too emotional. It's too painful. Everyone's behavior is uncalled for. They say, don't talk about it. And when people die, we don't talk about them. No, this is our problem. Okay. That is why till today, celebrities cannot manage their life. Because if once you are celebrated, you are not born that way, but we made you. Shatawale is not anything. It is his mouth that gave him chance to be who he is. So if somebody is such as Wale's mouth, you've not done anything. That's the first mentality. So the person is supposed to accept it like that. If somebody says because your somebody mouth that is big and is small, he has insulted you. If it's big, is he an insult? Okay. This is our problem. So when we talk about depression, anger turned upside down, what is precipitating your anger? That is where your depression comes in. Mm. So you are celebrating and the people are bashing you on social media. Oh my God. Why are they bashing you? Mm. Whatever they are saying. Is it true? Is it a lie? You understand? Mm. I mean, you have people who come and they will say hard things, piercing things. I remember when a fierce was nigga was caught cheating. Mm. She rather came and said, share it more. Share it more. Yeah, is, could, is it a way of... That could be a sign of depression. Oh, that? Uh -huh, I'll tell you what happens when they're depressed, they don't know. I said the first thing is that everybody can be depressed. But how to identify your depression is why you need a professional. So you get to know I'm depressed. So I know what to do with your depression. But that's a way of maybe, you know, diffusing the whole situation. You can't diffuse it. By saying that I don't mind. I don't. When mind. you throw more, they get more. So some also tell you, don't look at DKB. Goof big time on the Glow Festival. Mm. 
Then he apologized foolishly. I am sorry for not performing well. If it wasn't a good thing to do, he's a stupid boy. was it a depression he's at a, that moment? He's a stupid boy to do that. But after that, he went on silence as if he has, he's sick and is on admission. He doesn't want to talk. <laughs> People are advising him, don't talk at this time. <laughs> Keep quiet at this time. No! So I'm saying the first thing is that everybody can go through depression. Mm. There are people who are depressed now. They are on TV. They are on radio. They are hosting program, morning show. Uh, they are doing even mid morning, and some are even doing drive time. In their depression, when I are discussing with them, they work that can not even host people because of their depression. They can't do the job they are doing, but they are host. Mm. So there are so many people in this country who have hosted some of us, and they can't play it because during the interview, it was pre-recorded. What they went through was healing process for their depression, so they can't play it on TV. I want you to see the bigger picture of depression. So if Papi Kojo will come back and talk that way, and he gave you instances why people bash him, when you have the reason for your bash, you first have to check, are the people right to bash me? Simple. I, I think nobody has suffered bashing in this country on social media than George Lutroth. I had my Facebook ban, <laughs> my WhatsApp ban. I think they left me, they, the only thing they left for me was a Twitter to manage for the meantime. <laughs> but the rest of them, they banned them. Mm. When they banned those things, everybody came. Yeah, this is the time you have to go back. Uh, even I got, I got a bon one who is struggling with life to come and tell me you need somebody to manage you, somebody like me. Somebody who have just got out of marriage and are going to bring one child with no father since he wants to manage me. You see, such a sick person mm. because she is called herself a coach. There are a lot of psychologists, a lot of counselors who are going through depression and they've gone to study psychology. So they have problem themselves. So when they meet you, they share their problems with you and that is not counseling. Mm. So what I'm saying is that me, when it happened that way, I told myself, ah, this is the peak, peak of my career. Those who have stopped it on social media, their social media, you block social media, but I will still be on social media, not through my handle. So how, how, how do you handle yours? And That's what this is how I did. I didn't go quiet. I didn't take any of the advice. I heard all the things people are saying. Go up the scene. I was on the scene more than necessary. Because they've created a scene for people to ask counselor. Yeah, that was exactly what Efias Schwarzenegger was also doing. No, yeah, F yeah. F I, I don't care. Let me come out and no, say no, more. Own, and you say if you say more, no, FS, they get more. Efias own was not, I don't care. Because she went first to cry. Efias own was deficient. She was defeated. Mm. And wanted to find a way to come and say that my am I eh? So she was depressed. Until today, she has not been recovered. Mm. She's not recovered. She has not. She's still in that shock. Because if she's not in the shock, when you talk about a black versus Schwarzenegger, hey, trouble. She doesn't want you to talk about it. So it's, there, it's, it's, it's a sword that is not healed. So in that situation, how can that be healed? She needs a professional touch. That's where we don't, we all ignore. Mm. So my life, I was telling you what I, happened to mine. When they, what did I say before they banned me? They said, I said, don't allow a poor man to marry you. Mm. If you allow a poor man to marry, you will die early and go to hell. Who is a poor man? A man who cannot feed himself three square meals plus nine. They went as far as to the presidency. Me, George Lutroth. And that's why I took that statement and I started. No social media. Now it is radio and television. This is the human being. So when I finish right now on TV, then social media people take. Those who have the handle, they take. You see how the anger became. So the thing rather went wild and I was managing myself. I was okay. I was not angry. I didn't go through depression because I spoke the truth. And I knew that whatever, like what I'm saying here today, when I close and leave here, it will become another issue. People will come and share their mind and some will be like insult. So I'm saying that the first place is that know what is causing your depression. So Papi Coco didn't win the award. Yes, people go into a world with a winning mentality. That's the first mistake in life. Go into a world with a losing mentality. Because he who yeah, is but on that's the not, that's not staying positive. Well, who tells you that? If you, if you're going to an award that you've been nominated for by saying that, oh, I, I know I'm going to lose, that's not a possibility. You are going with a losing mentality. And in life, when you work with a losing mentality, he who is already on the floor fears no fall. So I'm on the floor. So are you saying that our celebrities most times expect too much from their fans and when they don't get that and they, they end up getting trolled, they expect, that's when they, they, they now get depressed? They expect too much from their non-performance. How is that? Because you know, you know yourself that when they nominated you, you, you are not qualified. You know. I mean, when people know themselves, they don't know the thing. They know they don't know. So why There are you, others who also know, who are right. doing very well in the industry, that you, one way or the other have been, have, have been think, lost on things like that. think they are doing well. And once you think you are doing well, one, 
Check if your followers are people who are poor. Because most of this competition, they are voting pattern. And voting is for the rich. So if the, the award is for voting, they know that those who can influence with money will take what you deserve. That's why. You get it? So once you are going, like people are going, and then you have the, look at the, the age of people they, they dominated you with. They call the uh, UGs, they call, you know, those people who are already loud in the system. And they put you inside. Remember that from that angle, two things involved. When you win, then you know it's a surprise. But go there with a the losing mentality. Now you didn't win. That's why I like Shatawali. If he loses, he uses this for lyrical content. You understand? When Shatawale loses in anything, he uses it for what? Lyrical content. I am too sure that very soon, Kwakasi statement, Koye Wano, Wano buy a bucket, it will be a lyrical content for Shatawale very soon, and we'll buy it. Mm. You understand? So the first thing is that know what is causing your depression. When so, you know so, it, so, so, Counselor, let's just say that now, if you doesn't know what is causing her all the depression and all, or if any other person for that matter, when it, should she come to you now? And, and and seek that that you help. should you should advise her to come because she needs to come and, and uh, would you be able to it's help her able. it's my work so when you say able then i don't have the tools i'm calling for mm. it's my work and what are some of the processes you pass the first thing is the that, that you have to maybe. identify the person's temperament profile it's not everybody that they are depression you see they know when they are depressed they have too much sex really papi kojo said he smoked more he didn't learn how to smoke when he was depressed so in life what you know how to do best in your depression, you practice it higher. Mm. There are people that when they are depressed, they eat more than necessary. So they, when, they, when they are depressed, they grow fat. Do you understand? So they both today who are cheating on their wives, and it's because they are depressed, but they don't know. So everything they will chop. And they, they are those who will take you home, they will finish all the things with you. When they break, then they ask you, when I know about her. This kind of go for you. <laughs> okay, so uh, <laughs> okay, viewers, Councillor John Luchard is here with me, and we're talking about uh, social media and our celebrities and the side effect of uh, trolls and bullies, which, of course, we're using depression as uh, an issue because Papi Kujo and a few others have come out to say, uh, speak about depression and what they had to, you know, uh, deal with uh, in that situation. Now, you can also join us with your comments and you can go on our social media pages and drop your messages over there. We open the phone lines for you to also get interactive with us. Counselor is in here and it's 030 uh, Those are the numbers you can call us on here. On showbiz now, my name is KMJ. Counselor, we'll be picking the course alongside your... your, so your when you identify it, now we take you through a process where we take you through how to manage your loss. Mm. We call it grieving stages of loss. Okay. Now, in managing losses, every human being strives on your temperament. And within the five folds of the temperament, the melancholy... Okay, the Counselor, let me pick Dari. Dari is on. Hello, Dari, are you there? Yeah, I'm here, I'm here. Okay, talk to me, bro. We're, we're listening. Yeah, I'm, I just want to talk to Counselor. He's here, he's here, he's listening. Go ahead. Yeah. Okay, talk to me, bro. Well, well, that's Lalo. You are the best. I just want to. You are the best. You are number one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very right. There's no doubt about it. Thank you very much. Okay, many thanks. Skipper is on. Skipper. Yeah, hello. Yeah, bro, talk to me. Yeah, you sure? You look good in your outfit. There's no doubt about it. Thank you very much. Okay, many thanks. Hello. Hello, Skip, are you there? Okay, what so you can also give us a call. Please, when you call, um, lower the volume on your television set, or better, better still, just put it off for us. We, we, it doesn't help. Hello? Hello, we have someone from Tadi. Hello? Hello, are you there? Yes, I'm, I'm still Can you speak up for us, please? Hello? Yeah, speak up for us, please. Yeah, my, um, my name is Naki. Okay. Oh, from a just as major point of view, I think it is totally madness, you know, because after you have been questioned cheating and then you come on social media, you think you are superstar. It is totally madness. Have a good day. Mm, okay. <laughs> Many thanks for your thoughts. Okay, Dorinda is our last person. Let, let's pick Dorinda. Hello? Hello? Yeah, how are you doing, dear? Hello, well, Dorinda. Okay. Hello. Yeah, go ahead. We can hear you. Um, I'm fine. What about you? I'm good. Hello? Go ahead. 
Oh, okay. So uh, that bad over there, then. Uh, forgive us. All right. So, uh, um, Councillor, now go ahead. So, so we'll wrap so you up. See, mm. in this act of depression, especially with celebrity, that's why I said it some time ago. Especially when Zale phone started their business. The first thing I told them was not to recruit. I told them, your, your business is not to recruit artists. The first thing they needed to do to get counselor on the bill to manage the artists. Most mm. of the artist managers, they are greedy people who want to look a few number you. So they have no knowledge. Mm. Because you talk to any artist manager, he says that, uh, 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 is, is, is your artist pregnant? They say, I don't manage your private life. I manage your music career. But if your artist is coughing because he has, he, he's coughing, can he sing? Mm. If your artists have rashes on the face, can they appear on screen? Mm. So you see, these people don't know what they are doing. So, so every record label should have a psychologist you and need a counselor. somebody to manage you. That is, look, when Lord Kenya repented, what did he say? He said he has to smoke wild before he gets on stage. Mm. So if your manager knows that all you can do is smoke wild and go on stage, it means that when you are not on stage, you are not friendly. So you meet most of the celebrities behind the scene, you shake them, they go like, uh, and the way you see them wild on stage, you think that they are supposed to be that way. So I'm saying, first and foremost, when you realize that you, something has gone wrong in your life, you want to have a change, we have to take you through the grieving process so that you know how to go. There are people today who are still in the stage of what we call bargaining. The stages are different. They are bargaining with the reality. Is it true that me and Lady win the award? I don't understand. It is because of this person. It is because of this person. So they begin to find fault who really caused it. Before they get to where they are depressed more, they don't even accept the fact that what is happening is happening. So my brother, you see, Papi Kojo's issue. So wrapping up, we're, we're wrapping up, Papi Kojo's issue is many issues for a lot of people. They even who have been changed. They even common program change that causes people to depress. Mm. They are common setting in an office that you have your own office. All of a sudden, they bring what we call workstation. So four is to one, people can be depressed and their okay. performance goes down. Okay. So if you want to work on your depression, like all the people we are seeing around us, the first thing is identify what is causing it. Seek for professional help so that you are assisted. So artist managers. Stop prayer meeting. Stop going to juju because people go, go to depression and they go and sit sick for juju means. But for me, okay. my work is that Papi Kojo must be helped. Okay. 0277, including here, including the other people. 0277 60 96 44. I'm responsible for my comment and I'm waiting for you on social media. 0277 okay. 60 96 44. All right. So, people, thanks for watching. My name is KMJ. I was born to talk. It's been a profitable 30 minutes. Many thanks to you, Councillor Richard, for coming through. God bless you. Hey!